developments now in a story the Target 12 investigators have been working for weeks. Rhode Island College will pay nearly $10,000 for an administrator's massive Verizon bill, but we found out taxpayers are on the hook for that payment, which is about the cost of one year's tuition. Target 12 investigator Walt Buteau joins us now with the details he's uncovered. Rick continues to claim this was a case of fraud. When we broke the story, Verizon said there was no evidence of fraud. Either way, taxpayers will take care of the bill. On the campus and nearby, word that taxpayers would cover the $8,000 Verizon bill was an uncomfortable shocker. Disgusting. Absurd. Outrageous. That's crazy. The bill was negotiated down from the original $156,000 for the month of July for data usage on the Rick iPad issued to Anacano Morales. The associate vice president of community equity and diversity told Target 12 the bill skyrocketed while she was on vacation in Colombia, but she said she has no idea what happened. According to a Rick spokesman, the college does not blame Morales, who was authorized to use device for college work while on vacation and while Verizon told Target 12 there is no reason to believe fraud occurred Rick continues to suspect the iPad hotspot was hacked Rick's John Tora Borelli also tells us quote the cost of conducting an international cyber investigation to prove fraud beyond a reasonable doubt would far exceed the small amount for which Verizon has agreed to settle Rick students and others we talk to do not consider $8,000 a small amount. Because tuition's pretty high, I work at the Boys and Girls Club, I make minimum wage. Oh, that's not very good, especially on the taxpayer's dime. To put the total in perspective, the $8,000 Verizon bill is equal to about one year of in-state tuition at Rick, slightly more than one year of room and board at the college, and about nine years of average cell phone bills. Rick tells us the college will examine its security procedures and implement any necessary changes. No comment from Verizon about the settlement. With the Target 12 investigators, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.